Good morning. Good morning. I'd like to begin with some brief information about your background. Can you tell us where you went to law school? I went to law school at Cleveland Marshall College of Law right here in town. And what uh, do you do? What kind of law do you practice? I have a general practice, so I've practiced in all the courts in this building, as well as across the street, juvenile court, and in other counties. So I do a lot of family law and civil litigation. I just don't do a couple areas. But. Has the Cleveland Law Library helped you with any landmark cases in the course of your career? Yes. I used to do my own research, and then I learned that uh, the law library has that service available. So in using the law library services for research, rather than doing my own research, I feel a lot more confident in understanding the breadth of the case that I'm dealing with. I've used it for court of appeals cases, criminal cases, juvenile cases, cases involving jurisdiction, exclusive and continuing, which is very confusing to me. So um, I, that's one of the most valuable things that this law library has to offer, and I wanted everyone to know that. By the way, it's a best kept secret. I tell other attorneys that all the time, and they're amazed that this service is available. What do you remember about our staff, past or present? Well, um, I think our staff, or the law library staff, is diverse, and I like that. Um, I like Leslie, I like you, Kathleen. I remember Sharla quite well. Everyone's always been so nice to me, and I always feel comfortable coming up here, whether it's to ask for help, to work um, on the computers, to do my own little bit of research. I love coming up here, plus it's quiet, and it smells nice, and it's orderly, and I just like it. Is there any other special memory you have of your time here? Um, well, in the past, um, I used to get very lost and confused because there's only one elevator that comes up here, and for years I thought I was going out of my mind, and, find, and I was too afraid to ask, and then finally another attorney who'd been here much longer than me explained to me that there's only one elevator. So that I think find humorous um, for myself. And other than that, no, that's it. Uh, tell us how you conduct legal research. What tools do you use? I use the law library. I don't do my own research anymore. I actually enjoy reading the research that the law library um, makes available for me because doing research is not my cup of tea. And I would dread that part of a case when I knew I had to do research. Um, but when I go to the law library, I feel so much more confident and I actually enjoy then the actual reading and digesting of information and I feel confident that what I'm reading is the most up-to-date and the most seminal cases in whatever area that I'm looking for. So that's it. Uh, what services that the Cleveland Law Library offers have you taken advantage of other than the research? Well, I've come up here for CLEs which I really like because they're well-timed. They're not early in the day when it's hard to find parking. Um, and I can usually, since they're in advance, schedule a court hearing on that same day. So it works out really well. Um, I also think that the CLE topics are useful. They're not just silly ones that I have no use for. And what else? Oh, I like using the computer quite a bit. And I also like that you have you know, coffee and hot chocolate. I like that. And what is your favorite service that the Cleveland Law, Law Library offers? Well, I like that you can join any time of the year. Um, usually I join when I need some pressing research done, and then it comes up again definitely every year. And then I feel more comfortable using the research. Definitely it's the research. And plus I like the environment, the ambience. Is there anything else you'd like to add? No, I just really support the Law Library, and I hope more attorneys look into why it's a, not only to support our law library, and it's well, you know, it's located in a very convenient place for lawyers. Even if you don't practice in this court and you practice across the street, it's well located and convenient, and it's important to support our own library.